Hi, in this video we're going to look at how to hide a button from user group. So we're going to see first of all how do we create a, a separate user, use a list of users uh, who, who can be registered to see um, the, the button that you're trying to hide from other users. So let's head over to Let's head over to the Odo default add-ons folder. So for this example, I'm going to use inventory app to um, change the settings or to make user group and security. So we'll head over to the, the basic. Uh, so you know how stock is basically um, the inventory app. You just head over to the directory and then go to the security folder and then edit stock security XML file. Um, what I've done here already is I've created these three lines of code which basically tells the application to create an XML ID which we definitely need in order to show or use in our um, to refer to when we're using uh, these specific list of users and um, for now we're just using the name boss to refer to this list once you create that and save it you can then head over to your UDA module um, then go to settings and go to grips and then search the name that you've kept which was uh, in our example was boss and so you'll figure out that this would show up here um, I've done a lot of sub changes here and I'll tell you what I've done so I've added some user lists this would normally be blank for you but for to in order to add users here who you would want to, uh, to allow to see the button let's go ahead and click add item and then you select your users and click select these again are the users who would be able to see the button any user apart from this will not be able to see the, the button that you're trying to hide uh, nothing else there are no changes required in other tabs and you just go ahead and save it and then we'll head over to I'm just gonna pull up uh, an invoice here and what you do is basically is use the administrator account and activate developer mode so as you can see here my developer mode is activated which is why I have debug in my URL now I'll open an invoice for this example, let's open this particular invoice. And as you can see, I can see this button here, cancel invoice. But I'd like to hide this for non-administrator users. And so I've also logged in to a non-administrator in another browser just to show how it looks like. So as you can see here, another user is logged in and uh, just gonna head over to the same invoice you see there's this cancel button we don't want non-administrator users to be able to see the cancel invoice and so what we do is we go to our administrator um, account we edit form view and in the inherited views you'll figure out account cancel 
uh, invoices right here. Now, we're just going to go to access right, add item, and then select the user group that we created, boss, select it, save it, and then you refresh the page. And then we similarly, so we go over to the non-administrator user and we, it's better to do control F5, it's a hard refresh. And you should notice that the cancel button is no longer appearing. And that's exactly how you do for other invoices. This is just for sales invoice. Uh, you'd have to carry out the same exercise for purchase invoice. And I hope this was helpful.